Hi, this is Aaron Lossness, and today I'm going to cover the present tense in Spanish, primarily the IR verbs. In this lesson, I'm going to cover how the present tense is used, and then I'm going to show you how to conjugate IR verbs, and then I'm going to show you 10 commonly used IR verbs, and lastly, we're going to use those verbs in a sense. So the present tense is used to report what is happening and what is true now. It reports on both specific now and general now. The structure is verb base plus the ending. So this is how you conjugate most IR verbs. There are, however, some irregular verbs and we'll cover those later. So for this exercise, we're going to use abrir to open and vivir to live. You replace the IR and you add the appropriate ending. So to say I live, you say yo vivo. You take off the IR and you add O. Now there's a couple ways to say you depending on whether or not you're familiar with the person. If you are, you use tu. So you live would be tu vives. For el, ella, and usted, you use e. So, she lives would be, ella vive. The nosotros form, or we, uses imos. And this is the only form that is different from the er verb conjugation. Other than that, it's the same. The er uses emos. But we open would be, nosotros abrimos. And lastly, ellos, ellas, and ustedes uses en. So, they live would be, ellas viven. Okay, I'm going to go over 10 commonly used IR verbs. I'm going to conjugate them in I, you, and they form. I'm going to switch between the formal and familiar for you, so you get practice using both. And I'm going to say it, then you repeat, and then we'll move on. Sentir, to feel. Yo siento, tú sientes, ellos sienten. Dormir, to sleep. Yo duermo, usted duerme, ellas duermen. Vivir, to live. Yo vivo, tú vives, ellos viven. Abrir, to open. Yo abro, usted abre, ellas abren. This year to say, yo digo, tú dices, ellos dicen. Vestir, to dress. Yo visto, usted viste, ellos visten. As you can tell, there's a few of these that are irregular. They're marked by the asterisks, and you're just going to have to memorize their pattern. Salir, to leave or go out. Yo salgo, tú sales, ellas salen. Reír, to laugh. Yo río, usted ríe. Ellos ríen. Ear, to go. Yo voy. Tu vas. Ellos van. Now, ear's a hard one. As you can see, it doesn't resemble at all what it looks like when it's conjugated. 
Unfortunately, ear is used a lot, so you definitely have to memorize this verb. Preferred ear, to prefer. Yo prefiero. Usted prefiere. Ellas prefieren. Okay, let's go over some practice sentences. I want to go over it and say it, then you repeat it. I prefer to eat alone. Prefiero a comer solo. She feels sick. Sentir. Ella siente enferma. We laugh all the time. Reír. Nosotros reímos todo el tiempo. You sleep a lot. Dormir. Two ways to say it. Tú duermes mucho o usted duerme mucho. Depending on how familiar you are with the person you're speaking to. She goes to school at night. The verb ir. Ella va a la escuela por la noche. I leave the country. Salir. Yo salgo del país. You live in San Jose, vivir, two ways to say it. Tú vives en San Jose, o usted vive en San Jose. We dress for work every morning, vestir. Vestimos para el trabajo cada mañana. They open the door, abrir. Ellos abren la puerta. She always tells the truth, decir. Ella siempre dice la verdad. All right, we've reached the end. If you want, you can email me at alostness at hotmail.com. I have about 30 to 40 exercises that you can put on your iPhone. Or you can go to my website at lostnessgroup.com backslash Spanish underscore lessons. There's about 40 videos there, and they come with workbooks to help you get through them. Thanks.